Hey everyone, welcome to the playthrough of Taris. Uh, today we're going to show you a full playthrough of our new game that's live on Kickstarter now. Uh, if you're already back, thank you very much for your support. Uh, if not, then uh, hopefully you'll check out this video and let us know what you think. Uh, my name is Jun, uh, this is Jin Jin. Hello! And this is Nikita. Hey! So uh, we've been playing game for a while and uh, we often play together, so uh, would you like to introduce yourself? Sure. Hi guys, um, my name is Jinjin. I've been playing about um, roughly 650 games throughout the past. And when I have encountered Taurus with June and Nikita, I was in love with the game. It's great and you guys should hurry up and watch this video and back it! Hey, so I'm Nikita. I'm the designer of this game. And here you can see the print and play version that we've created for you. I hope you will enjoy it and thank you for all your support, for all your feedback and just for being with us. <laughs> uh, I'm Jun, uh, I've also been playing for a while and uh, I've been working with Nikita here on uh, development and uh, law development as well as game balance and uh, playtesting. So uh, thank you for your support and I guess we will show you how this works. Hey, uh, so just a quick introduction about Taurus. Uh, Taurus is a work and placement board game in which you play the leader of a tribe uh, in this world which has been devastated by the beasts. Uh, since being exiled from the city, which you can see here, uh, they live in the desert and uh, they've discovered some ancient technology that supposedly allows them to defend themselves against the beast. Uh, this requires the building of a tower uh, named Taris, uh, which you can see here. And uh, throughout the game, you are competing to make the most contribution towards the tower. Uh, essentially, while you're working together to build the tower, uh, you're still competing amongst yourselves for uh, prestige. So prestige points represent your tribe standing in the council of tribes, and whoever has the most points at the end uh, will lead the tribes into the future. Um, so without further ado, uh, let's get going. Hey guys, uh, we're going to start playing now. So uh, this is a three-player game we set up, but Tyrus supports between one and four players. It's a solo mode, uh, and it supports up to four. Um, the rulebook is available for download on the Kickstarter, you feel free to check it out. Let us know if you have any feedback, and uh, uh, yeah, let's get going. Let's go! Uh, so, I'm currently first player, which means uh, I take two actions. So I guess my first two actions will be to try and get some resources. So we're trying to complete missions from this tableau over here. So based on what's available, I'm going to see like basically what I want. So it doesn't look like I'll be able to complete anything first. Yeah, we don't need yeah the, the uh -huh. missions that are currently in the tableau are quite expensive, so it will take us some turns. Alternatively, we could refresh the tableau in one of the locations and look or like try to test our luck. But anyway, it's a good idea to go for the resources in the first turns, so this is what I'm going to do as well. Since June is going for weaponry and knowledge, I will probably go all in for relics with my two guys. Both of my actions I'm spending to place my scouts in the shrine, which is a location which provides you with relics. Okay, but I have questions. So if I move here, this guy might come to me, right? Right, so they will move one space on the first turn, because this one's here. So but, I can, all... but I can move. On YouTube. Sure, right? that's fine. Yeah. As long as the location isn't limited by this symbol, then it means as many people there. You know, as many people could be there. Okay, let's go. Great. So okay. that's the end of the player phase. Now we're moving on to the beast phase, where the beasts are going to move. Currently, as you see on the altar track, no beast is moving two steps. So they will just move one step each in turn order. Starting with pay. So this one. Then delusion, then despair, and harrow. Right. So there is no choice at this point for them. Like there is no option for them where to move. So they are just moving out of the like uh, dead ends of the map, so to say. Okay. Okay. So uh, now it's... we're moving on to the next turn. Uh, the um, first player doesn't transfer automatically each turn. You have to go for for a specific location to get the effect to get a future first player token, which allows you to become first player next turn. Okay, great. Um, so it looks like if I don't move 
this guy's probably going to kick me out, right? Oh, this needs to move me. So the pain is faster this turn. Uh, at the end of every turn, this altar moves forward one step, and uh, it means that one of the beasts is faster. Only beasts one, three, uh, one, two, and three can move faster. Number four never does. So uh, the harrow is like a uh, huge crocodile, which is yeah. Uh, it's uh, mainly it's huge because of its tail, which is like two times bigger than the rest of the monster, and it's dragging behind it. Ah, so essentially, it can't move that fast. Uh, but in any case, this guy is really this guy pain is really fast. So um, pain devours your scouts, which means that uh, you'll die. But in Taras, death is not the end. Uh, not only do you get rewards from the council for dying, which could make it, you know, an interesting decision. Sometimes you want people to die. Uh, that sounds bad. <laughs> that sounds <laughs> terrible. But um, you can also revive them. So uh, this resource is called Ica. It's a uh, it's a mystical resource that's been recently raining down. No one knows where it came from. Is it the blood of the gods? Is it some other magical resource? No one, no one has any idea. But this resource powers ancient technology that they found um, in this in this world. Uh, and one of the one of the texts that it powers is something that allows you to revive. Uh, but after revival, uh, they're not quite the same. In that way. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> from the lore perspective, yes. I mean, you will still recognize your scouts. The uh, they will look the same in your reserves, but the the look in their eyes, it's just different. They will never be the same, okay? Uh, <laughs> Moving on, so I'm going to, um, as my first action, I'm going to get one Ica. So if you spend an action, you can get one Ica. If you spend two in the turn, you get three. But I need to save my other one to uh, collect. So everyone starts the game with uh, three Ica. So, guys. Since I'm behind, do I get one more? <sighs> Uh, mm, only if you're nice enough. Okay, okay so um, this one, uh, I'm going to grab one more, and then I'm going to collect both. So you pay an Ica per scout you collect. So uh, I'm getting one, so I have four total, and I'm going to spend two, and I'm going to grab these guys. So when, when I grab these guys, I get the reward of the location in which I grab them from. So this action is called collect. Uh, so two weaponry and two knowledge. Yes, as you might know from the rule book, you can never collect and place in the same turn which is a limiting mechanic in order not to allow you winning on the first turn. <laughs> <laughs> Great. So, moving on to me, I think, yeah, I'm not safe now because, like we said, Pain is moving two, two steps this turn, so my guys are under threat of being devoured. So, I guess I will collect and then get one occur. So, I don't, yeah. Basically. So I'm spending two acre to get my guys back, and I'm getting four of the relics, which is a lot. But that's a lot of relics, man. Yeah, I mean, I like the relics. Are you sure? You relics are good. Stuff? Don't forget to check out the tactics card as well. There might be something good. I did. Okay. I my next turn really is great. So okay. you can play one of these per turn, either before or after any action. You play. Okay, so I'm going to do something different. Than what the guys are doing. So first I'm going to put one of my scouts here which allows me to move a monster and flip it. Yep. So I'm going to choose to move him and flip. Right. Okay? Yep. And then um, I can put my person here instead. Yeah. Is that correct? And then so I get two tactic cards. You want. Thank you. And then you may exchange two resources for one if you want. Nah, that's okay. And for my, because I already have a tactic and I can play a tactic. Sure, you can also play the one you just got. Uh, yeah. Okay, so I can use one of them to move this guy somewhere else mm -hmm. where he cannot touch me. Is that what it says? Yeah, so move the hero anywhere to the board. That. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me think. Yeah. Okay, so. I'll just start that, and I think that is my turn. Is that correct? Right? Okay. Yep. So we are moving on to the beast phase now. Uh, so I'm still first player, so uh, I'm gonna move the beasts. Uh, this guy is gonna go after the closest location. I guess it's here, right? Because it's gonna go one, two. Uh, it's the closest I spot I can go. No, the, 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 yeah, it is. Yeah. Really so this guy. So this guy is gonna go one, two. Oh no! Not the end of the world. You are. Uh, you I are dead. 
but uh, you move this up one space. Oh, yay, yeah, okay. Um, unfortunately, the first reward is you gain the tower room. So to complete the tower room, you need to have two completed missions. Uh, so That's okay. We'll fine. do that later. But if you don't want to get the reward of the location, you can get an acre instead. So okay, can I have something. an acre, please? Here you are. Thank you. And uh, the second beast to move is this guy. Since he's flipped, he's just going to stand up. Um, and then it's going to be, so that's delusion. And then despair uh, moves one space. I guess it's going to try and get to, so one to here. One here. So it's actually not going to move because the closest uh, route it can do is one, two, three, or one, two, three. So either way, it goes through here, uh, which means that it's blocked and it can't move. If it, if it could move two spaces, then it could move through. But since it can't, it's just going to stay there. Um, and then Harrow is going to go after uh, this guy. Uh, since I'm first player, I decide which route it takes. It can go one, two, or one, two. So I'm going to go put it here. Yeah, that's the one. Okay. So you're preventing other people from getting your first players. So and don't tell me. <laughs> and um, okay, so uh, this turn I'm going to go for some other resources, I guess. I guess I need, I guess I need relics. But this, but this guy's faster this turn, right? So I'm going to be careful. I guess this spot's safe. And I guess this spot's also safe. Okay, so what I am going to do is something completely different. <laughs> I'm going to go to this special location, which allows me to move all of the beasts to an adjacent location with a higher number, with the highest number. So in turn order, it will resolve as follows. Starting with pain, it goes, the, the, the location with the biggest number is 10. So it's going here. Ouch! And it's hitting your guy. You know I'm going to remember that, right? Yeah, but it's helping you because you will get the rewards from the council. Okay, so... The bravery of your scouts will never be forgotten. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you can choose between uh, getting... reserving a mission, you can flip a beast, which I guess will stop me from moving another one. And you can get a tactics card. Okay, I'm gonna flip that beast. Okay. So can you flip that one for me? Yeah, I'm gonna okay, kill another two of my scouts. So now I cannot move that beast. And I'm moving on to the next beast, which is Despair. And it moves to number 11. And Harrow doesn't move because it's number 12 and this is the highest number. Okay. Okay. My second action will be to go to the... Hmm. I will go to the Abyss. And my, my other scout will go into the depths of the Abyss to try to find something useful. Unfortunately, um, when they return, they do not live that long, and one of the guys gets sacrificed. Okay. However, for that, I'm getting resources or artifacts. I choose to get an artifact. So these artifacts can be used as a wild resource. So as any of the four, uh, so either it can or one of the three uh, uh, resources, uh, or it can be used to block the effect of a beast on one of your scouts when it comes to you. So this can be really helpful if you want to keep a guy on board or you don't want to suffer the effect. Yeah. And because my guy was sacrificed and his bravery will, is remembered by the council, my token advances one step. I cannot build a tower room, so instead I'm getting an acre. Right. So on my turn, I would like to collect my guys back from the Cool. The guild. Okay, pay one. Right. Did you pay the Yes, I've already paid the two acres. Okay. And then um, now for my second action, can I get another acre, please? Great. Thank you. And no, I'm going to keep this later. <laughs> Alright, so uh, the beast move again. Yep. Um, so start so having with pain. Pain, right? So it's going to move. So it's going to go here. So as first player, I can choose the route it takes. So I would like this or this, I guess. Oh man, it's too bad he can't get there at one turn. <laughs> and uh, this guy stands up instead of moving. Mm -hmm. uh, this is going to go to, I guess, to the island. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the right one. Okay. Oh, it's going to this guy. Yeah. And, uh, and he will go for either this guy or this guy. They're um, equidistant, so I guess I'll, I'll move him here. And. Uh, that's it. Oh, don't forget to move this. So this guy is faster this time. 
And it's on me again, so I'm probably going to get out of dodge while I can. Let's see. Yep. So I'm going to collect. So these guys. Uh, so I get three of these. I get one of these. Oh, you're getting the relics, huh? Yeah, that's right. And uh, I, I will, one, so I guess, get yeah, one again. You do it. You're better at this game. <laughs> That's fatigue suppressor, basic construction, complex structure, proto language, okay. and make connections. Proto language sounds fun. Um, so I'm gonna spend the that I got. You wanted that? Sorry. <laughs> okay. So okay. I'm like, gonna spend the No, you just destroyed my life. Do you have three knowledge? I do. I How just did you get free knowledge? No! This is it. Oh yeah. Great. Four points. Oh, Nikita. Uh, okay. Oh, right now. He's... he's broke my heart. Okay, you're done, right? Alright, so this is an ongoing <laughs> effect, which means I'm going to place it here. And uh, it means that every time now, I, when I put the beast, I get a resource on my choice. Okay, refresh you a little. Okay. Oh, wow. On you, Nikita? On me? That one costs three weaponry. I think the safest thing now is to... Collect. You don't get anything when you collect from, from these spots. That's unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> but I have to save my scouts and most importantly my resources because the despair, which is in here, is gonna attack me here. And despair, like if you think that dying like for your scouts is the worst, you're wrong. The worst is to lose resources. <laughs> <laughs> Cold hearted. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I guess I will collect and gather one acre. Okay. However, let me let me think. Yes, I will. I will do something else. Okay. I will uh, return. I will use my tactic card. I will return a scout from the board and take a place action. You that might save me. You do best. So I'm taking this guy back. Now it's safe. And what what can I do? I mean, you can grab some resources. Uh, an option, or I might just go all in on the sacrificing. Like my heroes are so bad names <laughs> and so reckless right. that they just continue going to the abyss. No, what? Even in the face of uh, imminent death. Amazing. Would you like? I would like another artifact. Okay. He's letting us win. Is he? No. Is he? Are you sure? And, oh, yeah. and I'm advancing on this track. The council oh, track, right? Yeah. I'm gonna... Hmm. I might do that too. That's a lot of good resources for you. Hmm. I think I'm not gonna wait for things to happen. I'm just going to reserve a mission. Okay. I'm taking this one, which conveniently came up after Jim's turn. <laughs> this means oh, now yeah, that uh, I have a discount of one resource of my choice, which is, again, very convenient, because I have two artifacts, which are any resource. So I can complete this mission this turn. Right. Which is not as spectacular as June's performance, but it's still too important. Don't forget you still have an action. Yep, I do. So oh, oh, yeah, I have to complete it in the end of the turn, sure. So um I have in fact two actions. However, I don't have scouts. It, not not yet. Uh I will just gather three per okay. as my two actions. Mm -hmm. You spend two actions in the turn, you get three rather than one. Sure. Okay. So now I can complete the mission in the end of my turn. I'm mm -hmm. spending two resources. I have a discount of one. Mm -hmm. So these sisters transformed into weaponry, and I finish this. I complete this mission. Coming Where's your discount of one? I get two points. He, he reserved the. Uh, oh. So. Unfortunately, I don't have any tactics cards, but such is life. Uh -huh. I just want the points. So he has an immediate effect, which means that he can discard all of his tactics cards and draw a new one for each one. But uh, since he doesn't have any, I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah. I mean, this is unfortunate, but uh, I want to get some points. I want to be in competitive state. <laughs> and now um, the deploy is being refreshed. That... Okay. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. Yeah, not I can complete it, like, not now. But if I do not complete it, I think one of you should. Oh, no? Oh. 
Not enough. Okay, so... I can, I'm completely away to it. Like, the next second after you see the shit there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now it's my turn, right? And for my turn, I think I'm still safe if, if I go here, right? That's uh, absolutely safe, yes. That's, that's safe. absolutely safe. And For I now. really, really want tactic cards. Hmm. Do you have tactic cards still? I don't have any, just one. Really? I think that's a good one. Or I think that's a really well, good one. Well, that's a good one. Oh, so I'm going to try one. to take it from you. you Thank you! <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah. I hope it's good. <gasps> Is it? They have Ooh, a winning combo. That's pretty good. Um. I don't have a winning combo, but I'm going to. I sabotage Jesus now, so I'm going to sabotage you. So choose another player, take a resource from them. Uh, any resource, right? Yeah, any resource. Okay, that's the only other resource we have. And but you take a necker. Oh, that's okay. Okay. So you get some blood from me taking resources from you as Pinchu with a knife. The level of my disappointment <laughs> is immeasurable. <laughs> yeah, but the knife is imbued with holy water. So you get some holy blood in your body. Yep. That's good. That's holy good. ichor. All right. That is my first and second turn. I am done. Okay. Does he want to do anything here? Okay. So uh, I guess I'm still up there. So this guy will move one step and kill both of these. <gasps> and then he gets to advance two. Great. <laughs> That's horrible. Just as planned. <laughs> He's like Victorian mastermind. Okay. So let's see. I have. A lot of different options. Hmm. You do? Yeah, I do. Oh yeah, you, you can go, go like down. here, right. you can go here, and then right. you can like get one of these. Like that is true. Options. How can I stop to you a little bit more next turn? Mm -hmm. Think about your own game. I mean, I mean, uh, this is yeah. this is absolutely happening, and we're gonna be before it gets moved. Okay. So mm -hmm. as to prevent you from getting some resources. Backstabbing is the way of life. <laughs> oh, no. I just gave you an acre. Acre, you should thank me for it. And then. Seriously, I'm pretty happy. Unfortunately. Uh, no, actually, I will change this story. Really. So, my action will be to get a resource in the liquor. The resource will be. Mm, let's say knowledge. Okay. Okay. And then. After this one, I'm proceeding to get the future first player token, which means I will be the first player next turn. Ooh. And you decide one of these goes, huh? Next turn. Okay. Next action is Delusion Mist. So you move one step, I guess, here. And then the spell will move two steps. So one, two, I think. Mm -hmm. And this guy is closest to this, and then so he'll move here. After this okay, piece. tell me, so I can get a resource. Two resources. Okay. <laughs> and uh, this moves, so now no one's moving faster this turn. Okay. And uh, back to you, who's your first turn. Yeah. Now for something completely different. Now all of my guys are in the graveyard, which is unfortunate and fortunate at the same time because the last guy to be revived is costing only one acre as opposed to three. So there is a force revive action. Normally, if you want to force revive your guy in an action, you spend three acre. However, since all of my guys are dead and uh, the gods have forsaken me, I can only spend one acre to get my last guy back, which right. is what I will do. Tusk. I'm getting my last guy back as the first action, and I'm sending him to the eye location, which is the eye of the dead, where, which is where the people are getting resurrected. And I'm spending three more acre to resurrect the rest of my guys. Wow. You see? Not bad. <laughs> wow. So you can re revive all three of them? Yeah. yeah. If, if I have enough acre. Yeah. Uh, Plus one acre could go. Oh my. Okay. And now it is my turn. I would like to recall. Call one of my guys back, please. This and guy? yeah. What about this guy? No. This guy, I think I'll be. So <laughs> I will recall the guy for one acre. Uh -huh. 
And then I'll get another favor okay. for my second action. Sure. And because I recalled my guy, um, I get two relics, please. You all. Thank you. And let me think. If I can sabotage you to someone. One piece of Nah. Nah. You gotta start saying this turn. <laughs> Um, yeah, unfortunately, all of them require sorcery, which I can't. But, your turn. You can refresh the tablet here, I guess, so. Yeah. Uh, what do I want to do? I guess I'm going to complete more missions. I need more resources. Nothing's moving really fast this turn, so I guess this one's safe. This one's safe. Uh, and... Hmm. Maybe I'll grab some taxes cards. Yeah, because I don't have any. So two taxes cards, I don't have resources to trade, so that's it. I can play one of these. Oh, great. So this is just gaining some resources. So gain the knowledge and gain the weaponry. That's cool. cool. I do it's it actually like Am no, I? Oh, I have just enough to do that mission. What? what? No! <laughs> no! <laughs> that was that was very fortunate. That's okay. Right, can you give me that mission? Yes. Great. Backup plan. So this is that was my backup plan. Backup plan. <laughs> so two points, and I get an artifact, which is helpful. Okay. Okay. So I will refresh one, add an additional one. Yep. And it'll be smooth. What? <laughs> Seriously? Okay, be smooth. The beast case. So, yeah, so moving on to the beast case, now I'm the first player, so I'm choosing where, like, if there is a uh, tie, I can choose where the beast will be. <clears throat> However, I don't see any ties for now, so this is going here, and this guy's dead. Uh, yeah, okay. So, because now I have two missions, I can actually complete a tower room, which is great. It's terrible. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, so I get three points, and I get to grab one of these, so let's see. This one I can provide. Ooh, quite a few interesting ones. I guess this, this one is just easier. So, the best, I mean. Ignore the Ica cost of missions, so now I don't need to pay Ica for missions, which is Good and bad. Wow, that's pretty good. That's, that's pretty good because like around half of the missions in the deck have eco cost. Okay. So upon getting this, um, I place my marker here just to indicate I did it. I have the two missions required. Uh, and for the next one I would need four and six, etc. Uh, and going forward I ignore the eco cost of missions, which is great. And also the spy gets upgraded. So uh, as the tower rooms are constructed, the location on the board will also upgrade. So this is the Spire. So the new effect of the Spire is, in addition to the previous effect, which is you can reserve a mission and then refresh the tablet or vice versa, but you also get a tactics card now. Cool. So it's better. I love tactics. I'm going to Have you game. got your points? I did. I got three points. Yep. Okay. So okay. moving on to the next beast. Hmm. So Delusion is going to go here again. And then Despair is going to move on to here. And then Harrow's going to go here. No, no, no. Oh, oh. sorry. I, 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 I know, I was waiting for my resources. What so. you doing? <laughs> Your guy you. is dead, but it seems that you're happy about it. Can I, can I get a weaponry? And, a weaponry. Um, and a good piece. Thank you. you. I'm so rich. <laughs> okay. I'm just waiting for the right card. Oh, that's going to come up, I know. Yeah, it's going to come up. Okay, <laughs> next turn. Next turn. Yeah, it's you still. Yes, yes, it's me. Okay, so um, I need to set up to complete the tower rooms with council track because the grow, which is another way to complete tower rooms, is occupied. Yeah. Unfortunately. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to advance on the council track by killing off more of my guys. What? Just, <laughs> I mean, you would say such is life. Such is life. What would you like? I would like two weaponry. There you are. But he has so much eager, like that holy blood that revives. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm setting up to revive all of my guys. I, I mean, know. I, I do take it. care about them. <laughs> sure. I don't think you care about them. <laughs> and once this guy is being sacrificed, I can advance on this track. Yep. I'm going to move here, mm -hmm. which is revive a guy. And oh, place him again. Wow, convenient. Sweet. So I choose not to go back immediately to the start, mm -hmm. which is an option for you. When I you hit the last one, you can go straight back to the beginning. Which 
situation. Bro. Yep. So you have some fun. Uh, I'm going here yep. and flipping this piece to keep me safe from in, in both of these locations from like losing these orbs to keep me safe too. And I'm okay. going to uh, now as a second action of this location, I'm going to go back to the start. So it's the second half of this location that you move forward one space. Yeah. So I guess you're trying to set up for this? Uh, yes, but well, I don't have a second mission completed yet, which is very sad. But I'm going to reserve one of the missions for the tableau as my second action. I'm going to take this one. <laughs> this is reserved. So that gets refreshed, right? It will get refreshed at the end of the turn. No, it gets refreshed. Too. Oh, the yeah, yeah, absolutely. Sorry. And you also get a tactics card. So this is all discarded. I get a tactics card you. because that no, location was upgraded. When you complete it, you may move the delusion one space. I think I have helped you guys too much by refreshing the tableau. So I know. That's, that's such is life, alas. So this mission is reserved. Maybe I can complete one of the missions from this. Hmm. I don't know if it's worth it. No, I choose not. Instead, I will complete the reserved mission that I have. Well, let me see the tactics card. I choose not to play it this turn. Um, so I will complete this one. I have a discount of one. I will thus spend one relic less. And this is all gone. However, this is a one-time effect mission and I don't have any scouts in my reserves. So, again, unfortunately, I don't get the effect. However, I get three points and I'm set up to get the, the fancy tower. Nice. There you are. Did you? So, my turn. I would like to reserve a mission here, please. So I will take this most expensive one, wow. where it lets me revive four scouts. Put it on that side. That side. And also refresh the tablet. Yeah. So all of these cards are gone. Yeah, because of the second part is back. It's okay. unfortunately no option. Because they're good, I don't want you guys to have it. Yeah. Well, these are even better. Yes. <laughs> sure. Uh, they all cost their kill, too. So that is my first action, right? You also get a tactic card. Oh, and I also get a tactic card. Perfect. Upgrade. Oh. So you have another action? Um, yes, I have another action. And for my second action, I'd like to take an Icker, please. So you are. Okay, one sec. So now I would like to play a card. Okay. Swap the positions of any two beasts on the board. So just to just to make it clear, this guy will keep on devouring once it hits a person. Right. Is that correct? Right. So if I put him here, he will or here, he will continue to devour. Yeah, right. Swap them, not move them. Oh, okay. So you swap. So I would like to again. swap it. Yeah, with one. him. Oh. So now he goes here. Yeah. Was he here? He was here, right? Yeah. Complete one of my reserved yep. um, choices. So these are three, and that's two, and here's one, and here's one. Great. Right? Yep. So I get to revive all my babies. Wow. Please. Oh, uh, you, you get to keep the mission. I get to keep the mission. And I will get four points. Wow, that's a lot of points. Thank you. Okay. And, and I get these guys back. Woo! Well done. So See, we'll I don't intentionally kill my guys. Mm -hmm. mm. I am thinking that I could do this. So I'm going to go here, go, sacrifice this guy, uh, and I will get two resources of my choice. It's going to be, I guess, feathers. And then uh, this will mean that I also get to reserve a mission. So, this one sounds fun. I'll reserve this one. Oh yep. no. And then, uh, I, as my second action, I will just get the nickel. 
uh, and then I'm also going to play this. So choose a resource type, gain one for each of your scouts in the graveyard. <gasps> so I guess I'll get some knowledge, or oh, some weapons, okay. That seems to be more useful right now. And then at the end of my turn, I'll complete a mission, so I guess just this one. Okay. So I get one point. Use mission card. How can we stop them? Variable. Oh, and I hit 10, so that means uh, all of these locations are swapped out. Yeah. And it's actually bad have loaded down. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to swap these out while you do that. So we're going to have some new and interesting locations come up with any luck. So just more resource acquisition spots. Cool. This one's interesting. So, yeah, so three resource acquisition spots. This one, this one, that one. Mm -hmm. And this one is an interesting choice where you can either spend two acre to move a beast two steps, or you can flip a beast and get two acre. Wow, okay. So that was me. So at the end of my turn, it's the beast phase, right? Yeah, yep. absolutely. So this guy goes here. Ooh. So we are sacrificing our guys. Oh. They are being devoured. Oh. Oh. You guys like this. In turn order, we are advancing on the council. Oh, so this yeah. is happening. I've set up <gasps> the first tower room. What up? I'm getting three points. Okay. And I think I will choose to get the grove, which means that every time I construct another tower room, I will get additionally two points. Wow. So the grove is now upgraded. So now the grove, in addition to giving you an option to complete the tower room for five points, uh, has another option. You can discard two artifacts to reduce the requirements of missions. So instead of like having two missions to build one tower room, you only need one if you discard two artifacts. Temporarily, right? Temporarily. It only counts for one uh, completion of the tower room. Next time you will still need the even number of missions mm. unless you use this action again. True. Okay. So now it's on you to oh, yeah. advance on the council tracks. Okay, I will get... I guess I'll just get some more resources. So one acre and the one I don't have. Knowledge. Basically, I need to do it. Right. Great. So that was, uh, that was, that was pain. pain. And then no, illusion. illusion. It's gonna go, I guess, here. Mm -hmm. only move, oh, everyone move only moves yeah. one step, but it's, I think it's uh, safe to say that there is no choice. Mm -hmm. Then this one is standing up to give it what it is. And now there is an interesting choice for me. Yeah, do you if, wanna die more? If, if I <laughs> want to kill off two of my scouts, or if I want to kill off someone else. So, as the first player, you can decide whether Harrow goes for my guy here or for his guy here and because the harrow will continue to devour if he uh in beast phase if he moves he'll go here and then also devour this guy too so do it so i think i think harrow will go completely bonkers <laughs> Whoa. and just go through all of my guys yeah because harrow usually only moves one space right? and now like after devouring two guys it has no other guy to continue so it just stops in this location okay. This is all sacrificed. Oh man, I'm helping him. Like, come on. And yeah. I will reserve a mission as my first reward. I will reserve. Hmm. What do you say back? I'll, I guess I'll get one of the cheaper ones. Okay. And as my second action, I will go here. Get some resources. And I will get some resources. So one acre and. One. Which will be uh, one acre and one weaponry. weaponry as well. And we refresh another position, right? Yes. That'd be a good one. Ooh. Okay. Now is on me again. Yep, mm -hmm. new turn. Um, this one moves, so pain is now fast. Hmm. It seems that I'm in kind of a pickle now. <laughs> Because three of my guys are in the graveyard and one of the guys is on the board, but he's doing nothing there. Oh. He's just having fun with your guy. With your guy, sorry. I know. My guy's doing nothing there. He's just chilling. Yeah. 
Bad it's in such, in such dire times, they're just <laughs> shitting there. You really need this card. Bad swords. It's expensive. Look how much I paid for That's it. That's a good card. I know, but it's an amazing card. Hmm. So I think it's safe to say that I need to recall that guy, which is unfortunate that such a life. So I will get one acre and then I will spend it. Like, as my first action, I'm getting one acre and then I'm spending it. So you get that one back. To recall one guy. Great. And before I go to the end of my turn to completing the missions, I will play an excess of opportunities. I get two practice cards, and I may play another one, which doesn't count towards the limit of one per turn. And this is great for me, because I will play equal distribution, and I will have to help everyone. I will get eight points. And then I choose a resource type, and each player gains one of those resource types. Right. I will choose to get a weapon. Ah, so we all get a weapon. Go on. Thank you. Thank you. So this is now discarded. And now I can proceed with completing the missions. So this one, if you're completing it from the mission tableau, you ignore the eager cost. So I only spent one. Wow, that's true. Uh, one of those to complete this, and I'm getting another point. Okay, there you are. That is my turn. So now I think I'm going to play a different strategy for Nikita here, because I have a lot of living guys, and that's the point on the board. Right now, okay. So I'm going to put um, one of my scouts here, mm -hmm. where it allows me to move this baby somewhere else. Mm, let's go. That's yeah. a good choice. Oops. And it's good. It's good. It's good. Uh, it's good. So yeah. that was perfect. And then it allows me to put another guy here. Yep. Right? So why? Where I sacrificed this one to get to any resources of my choice. So I would like to get two of the um two. Can I get um a knowledge, please? Sure. It's two of the same. So two okay, so two knowledge. Yep. And then additionally for here I can spend two, two to swap for artifacts. To swap for an artifact. Thank wow. you. Okay. And now ending my turn, I would like to spend three artifacts. You still have another action. That was just one. Oh yeah, that was just one action. And then for my second action, I would like to take a paper, please. Paper. Thank you. And then at the end of my turn, I would like to spend three knowledge to purchase daring rescue. When completed, you may revive one of your scouts. Wow. So, boom. Mm -hmm. Well played. So two points. Okay, so my turn. Um, hmm, I guess I'll have to revive that guy. Oh, uh, we call that guy. So I'll get the nicker and spend it to get him back. So I have to spend one to get two resources of my choice, which are the same. So I would get, I guess, uh, two weapons, which allows me to complete that mission over there. So for one of these and three weapons, I will do that mission over there. Sure. You have council number of gifts. Okay. I'm sure he's happy. So. Now, that. every time I complete the tower room, I get two tactics cards. And I get two points. Cool. Okay. Cool. Okay, so we flip another mission? Yep. And the beast move, right? They do. Starting with pain, which just yes. stands up. Then the delusion will go here and move this guy to chill in another place, in a much nicer place in the world. Mm -hmm. um, this guy is going to go move out of the uh, terrible dead end, which is stuck in. And this guy is gonna... I guess it's my choice, so uh, it either goes to this one or to this one. So mm -hmm. I choose so him to go for this one, and that's not move at all. Yep, he chooses this route, and it's blocked by this. Oh, okay. Great, so yeah, back to you. Okay, so now it's on me. 
I need to make sure that my guys go back healthy. So this is the second time they're coming back from the, uh, the dead, right? Yes. It is, it is. So I spent three acres to revive three of my wonderful scalps. And as my second action, maybe I just continue sacrificing the cohorted one. I mean, it's the circle of life, I guess. That is true. <laughs> the thing is, I need to set up to complete another tower room. Yep. So that might be a good action to just go here. Two resources. For two resources of my choice, which will be knowledge. They are. And then this advances here. So I can recall a guy from the board and place him somewhere else. Wow. Which will be in here. <laughs> so one of my guys is going to the graveyard. Amazing. And I'm going to get an additional action token, which okay. allows me, upon expenditure, to have an additional action. Mm. And then I choose to go back to the beginning, okay. this time. And in the end of my turn, I'm completing a reserve mission. Mm. By spending two of those. Uh, in fact, I will spend it like this. Okay. So, now I get two points. That's me. Oh, then I set up the last one. Right. So, yes. <laughs> Terrible. Yes. There's some, 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 some collusion is happening over there. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that's still two points. Mm -hmm. And I'm set up to get another tower room next turn, probably. So, so that's my turn. Oh, you have this, right? So, that's an ongoing offense. So that goes here. Oh, yeah, that's true. Okay, on um, you two. Okay, so I would like to, not like Nikita, recall two of my guys. So I need to spend two acres, right? That's right. There's two acres, and then I'll recall these two. Great. And your second action? And my second action. I would like to get another acre back. Great. Thank you. That is my turn. Do you want to play fast one? No, not yet. Okay, um, on me, I am, I guess, just going to grab three acre. Because I need acre, that's my action. And let's see if I can do something. I do not think, oh, I could do this. But no, I should not do it. Okay, so now it's on the east. Yep. And this terrible thing is happening. <laughs> yeah, right. Massacre of the Abyss. Stop smiling when you say it. <laughs> so now I advance one step first. Mm -hmm. I complete the tower, which gives me three points. One, two, three. Then two more points because of my growth. Oh like, wow. Nice combination. One, two. Wow. And then I get a card of my choice, which will be this one, because it helps to revive scouts, and obviously I need that. <laughs> Um, well, I, I place a token here, and then I advance one more step, which will probably be reserving a mission. I will reserve something of value, like this one. Great. Okay, so I will flip another one. Okay. Yep. Now, the delusion is going to move in here, and take this guy back to the spire because he's still chilling in the garden. <laughs> and um, the despair. Let's see, one, two, three, four, probably this is the shortest one. But so it goes here. Yep. And the harrow will probably go this way. Yep. Okay, so next turn is still you. It is me. Oh, me. so every time you construct a tower and you may gain the Future. Yeah, I mean, that's, that's not great, not terrible. <laughs> so now, all of my guys are dead again, unfortunately, and I need to force revive one of them for one. Okay. And then, 
let me see. Better hurry up. Seems like you're racing ahead. Interesting. So I revive the guy. I will place him in here. Mm. Flipping this guy. Mm -hmm. And then advancing one step on this track. Mm -hmm. Which gives me. Let me count. So I need. Uh, well, an acre and mm -hmm. a weapon, let's say. Weapon, yeah. Okay. So. And then I'm, before I end my turn, I'm playing this card, which is Extreme Resilience. I resolve the effect of the spot where my council track is. Wow. Okay. So I get another couple of resources, which will be an acre and a relic, let's say. And now I'm completing the reserved mission that I have for. Let's say those. Okay, so you gain three points. Wow, the racing ahead. So he's hit 20, which means he's get swapped again. Okay, so we'll have time to catch up. Yeah, uh, the thing is with this tactic, yeah. you never have enough resources, and people who are collecting resources can get ahead. Like second in the second half, of the game, which is usually what happens to me. <laughs> Alright, did you call you? Yeah. Oh, this is you get some cards from the discard pile. This one is oh, this one is at the end of the B space, so after everyone moved, you can pay two Ica to go in where you wish. Uh, this one is you can spend three resources of your choice to immediately recall, which usually allows you to break the rule that you're not allowed to place and collect in the same turn. Which is specifically good for this location. Like you go in there, you place the same guy in that location, and then you have five points. Recall. Yeah. If you have the resources, sure. This one is uh any three resources. Oh, okay, you return any scout to its own reserves and place it in its location. And then the owner can also immediately place it in another resource. Wow. Cool. Nice finding too. So I am ready for my first want. action. So for my first action I will go here. Ooh. And then I would like to take this one. Yeah, the below one. one. And you you will get the bigger right, one yeah. next turn. And then I would like to move him. You can move, move the altar. Oh, I moved this one. Hmm. I would like to move him here. Okay. And you also get. And then I also get a tactic. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So for that, that was my first action. And then so my second action, I would like to place this baby on. Okay, that, and I would like to play a card. So I would like to play this card, mm -hmm. and then I'll get two of the same type of resource while you guys get, each get one of them. Okay. Can I get relics, please? Thank you. Can we get one each? Nice. You're welcome. I found you. You have to block it. It's blocked. Block one is. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Did I play with them? <laughs> you must have. All right. I'm actually going to just grab some tax cards in that case. Yep. So I'm going to shuffle this card pile and draw two of them from the discard pile. So, let's see. so I guess we'll be seeing some of these effects again. Or I could go here. That might make more sense. Yep. Then I'll die. Yeah, that might be also. Awesome. Instead of doing that, yeah, I'll just grab two from the actual pile. My second action is to get a nicker. Uh, okay, that's interesting. Yep, I will do this. So move my castle track to another spot in the same column and gain rewards. So I will get an artifact. And also here I can swap two for one, so I'll swap two nicker for, I guess. And then I'll see if I can complete the mission. Oh, that one, yeah. That's great. That's great. Yeah. Convenient. This one. So I get two points. Oh man. Jim took all three of the missions. 
Okay, once the turn is action, I may spend a resource to advance one step on the counter track. That sounds good. I think I'll swap it out for this. You don't have money for it then. I do not, and I will also not act for it. Oh, yeah, that it will be me. I'm done, right? So that would be smooth. And that would be smooth. So, like, they each move once. Yeah, I'm still first player for a while, so this is dead. So, I get to advance. I will go here. This is from the board. Copy. You can't go. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Get a nicker then. Oh yeah, you can right. Yeah. And this is going here. Mm. Okay. Back to the fancy plate from the double plate. Yay! And I can move one. You didn't die. Oh, mm-hmm. I didn't die. Darn. Yeah. My sad sad life. <laughs> Sometimes not dying is a sad thing. Jeez. And <laughs> this guy's coming here. Yay! So you are losing. You are not dying, but you are losing in the river. Really? Yeah. Really? That's really hard. That hurts. That hurts. That hurts. Here, I'll lose okay. this. It hurts more than the dead scouts. And this guy is going here, so my guy is being killed now. <gasps> and it continues to move, no? And oh, not because it's oh, not because there is another monster. So I'm getting the future first player token. Can I have it, please? What? No! <laughs> that was hard! <laughs> That's on top of you. Okay, so I will. Continue being the first player on the next turn, which is great and not great at the same time. It is what it is. Before I start my first turn, I would like to play some cards. So, my first card, I'm going to play a joint effort, which allows me to play two times wow. this turn. Nice. Okay, so, um, that's funny. Move one of your scouts to your reserves. From your reserves to the graveyard, so bam. Without advancing. Um, without advancing oh. down the track token, but I get a point. Oh, getting close. I'm almost there! Yay! Okay. And then the second one is I get to complete a mission or a reserve a mission. Is mm-hmm. that correct? That's right. So I would like to reserve. What do I have to mind for? Um. This one, I guess. Great. Okay, and that is not my actions yet. So for my actions, can I just obtain three acres? Sure. For the cause. Thank you. And my people can die. Oh. Not a big deal. I've learned this from Nikita. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, for and this is now the end of my turn. So the end of my turn, I can um complete a mission mm-hmm. and. I don't have to spend that, so I just spend one acre to complete this mission. And right. when this mission is completed, I get another point, and I can move my council track token to another spot in the same column and resolve wow. its effect. Pretty strong. So I will move it here and take back one of my babies. Kind of place him, I guess. Um, yes, take back one of my babies and put them back. Is there anywhere I can get points? You can get points in the garden. In Your favorite the garden. Spot. Boom. Okay, so I get another point. Wow. Okay. And getting close to the end here. What's the other one? What's that one? So that is place the fruit. It's okay. Fruit. So. And I will place the fruit. Finally, I get to place the fruit somewhere where they cannot touch me, but I do want them to touch me in this case. So mm-hmm. let's. Can I place them? Let's put them here. Okay. Okay, great. So Alright, and then that is my turn. Wait, can I buy another card? Uh, you did one mission already? Oh, yeah, I already did one mission. Okay. That's, um, that's it's a one of turn. So, looks like I'm a little bit stuck. Uh, I still have this reserve. Maybe I need to reserve more. So, I'm gonna go here. Uh, I will reserve, I guess, this one. Yeah. Sure. And, uh, and then I will refresh the tableau to get a card. Oh, this one's great. So I'm going to spend two acres to get a point. Could you notch me up one point? Yes. And I will complete the mission. So I'm going to do this one. So I don't need to spend acre. So I'm spending just this. Or oh, actually, it's free because I, I I get the acre discount from this and I get this discount yeah. from the one. Wow. Okay, so I can just. 
do this for free. And I discard this one for two points, so I get three points. Three points. What? So this is one. Okay, great. Cool. Hmm. That's, that's not good. great, that's not great. Let's see what I can do here. I need to hurry up with the last. Uh, oh, I can buy. I forgot I can buy. Mm -hmm. I am only so two points away. So the end game will start if somebody hits 40, yeah. or if one, or if this is taken. Okay. Which will mean that the beast, so this represents the tower being like fully completed. Yep. And uh, upon completion, the beast will start being destroyed one by one. Right. So at the end of the turn in which this happens, then uh, this uh, the harrow will, will disappear, and then uh, despair, and then delusion, and then Ooh. finally pain, and then the game will end. Ooh. Um, and whoever has the most prestige will win. Okay. Looking close. Okay. So what's gonna happen is I'm gonna continue sacrificing my guy. <laughs> because this entire times go for direction. They always did. Apparently through the whole game. So <laughs> I will get some resources, which will be probably weaponry. Okay. Weaponry. Thank you. <gasps> No. And I will advance one step, which will place a food token, which has already been placed. I have no intention of changing that location, so I just replace it in the same location. Sure. And my sec. Uh, well, I don't have. Um, I have a second action. I'm going here, which allows me to resolve a uh, immediate location effect, as if I have placed there, and as if it was empty. Okay. So I'm resolving this one, mm. which is the circle, the circle. So I flip the beast. I will flip this one, and I can advance two steps because of the circle. Going back for free, and then advancing another step to the middle of the last one. Mm. Wow, for three points, for five points, because wow, oh, that's powerful. So can that's you start powerful. Give him five points. Alrighty. Okay. So. He's and like now I can play any number of tactic cards for him, which and is you want wow, to I'm going to take really... one of your tokens. Uh, yeah. yeah. Cool. So that triggers the end game, it does. right? So at the end of this round, at the end of this beast phase, oh, uh, Harrow will disappear, and uh, yeah, let's do the beast phase. So who's who's first? Oh, I'm oh, still first. Yeah. Oh no, you're you're off yeah. that. Sorry, I forgot to give this to you. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. So, so uh, the beasts are moving, we should resolve the movement, which is, this guy will go here, if, I mean, there is no okay. time. So this guy will go here, mm. then... Then Delusion. Delusion will delusion go... Delusion will go for the biggest number, so it goes here. there. Okay. This guy just flips up. So, doesn't one of them get removed? Yeah, well, after the game, right? yeah, after oh. the old... And this yeah. one will Perfect. devour, start devouring. Yeah. So you and me. So, so starting with you. Starting with me, I can either take a resource of my choice or go here with, which is an extra action, correct? Yep, yeah. like a call. So, extra action token, woohoo! Alright, and then I will choose, if I stay here, I can keep on getting this. Mm, only if you have some card that gives you something. Okay, so I would go back for free. Sure. Okay, on me, okay. I will reserve a mission. I will reserve the most expensive one in attempt, uh, attempt to, to, get, some to get it. Yeah. Okay. And that's all. Okay. Okay, so. And uh, one of the beasts will disappear now. It will. Harrow will be okay. destroyed. And we shall the beast for you. Okay, and uh, now it's on me. You. Oh man, I don't have any Okay, guys. so we have three more turns now, and then at the end of those three turn fours, we'll see. Now that there's no more tower rooms, uh, it's still possible to complete tower rooms and get points, for example, here or here, as long as you have the mission required. But it represents kind of like putting the finishing touches on the room. Yeah, the like the, the backup loot. <laughs> I guess. So you don't get the card, but you still get the points for your efforts. Hmm. Okay. So, my turn, correct? Yep. There is no point of me moving on that track at this moment. So, um, 
You can still do another run for three points if you would if you have position to climb. Yeah. You do in fact. So let's So see. if I spend a resource? Two of them. A resource. Oh, one, 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 one resource and one acre. I will use this one, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. So I'll spend two. Yeah. Or if I'm hungry. I'll spend two. So now for my actions, I will try to force revive one of my guys so that I can replace them this turn. Yep. Is that correct? That's right. So I like to spend three Icar and then revive one of my guys. Okay, that's not going to be enough. I would like to move this guy to perform this action. I need some tactic cards. Mm -hmm. There you are. Thank you. You can swap two for one as well if you want. Yeah. No, that's okay. And then for my third action, I'll keep my third action for now, but I would like to play an artifact. And for this artifact, I get three relics while each of you get one. Oh, you mean a tactic card? Yes. Okay, and so with my three relics, so that's two of my actions, right? Okay, so now I would like to use my third action, correct? Yep. And then my third action to gain an anchor. Thank you. Okay. And so now it is my turn to purchase some of these mission cards. So this looks like the mm -hmm. one that I can purchase. Okay, so I will spend two of these, one of these, to purchase this card, Indecisiveness. That suits me. Okay, so I'll get two points. Wow, way ahead. Can I just not perform this action? Cause yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, and yeah. we're gonna refresh another one. Cause this is a cheap, cheap one for a lot of prestige points. Whew, I think I need to get my guys back so that I have people to complete rooms with. We get a ton of points that way. But hmm, I want to have acre. Let's see if this is gonna help. Oh, that's great. Three acre. Uh, and I will go here, right these two. two. That is good. Oh, it's actually upgraded, so I just spend one to revive two. Yep. And uh, I'm also gonna, I guess, spend my other action. That's a pretty good catch up mechanism. To go here. You have to save wait for right? for yeah. yeah. Oh, no, it's not safe, it's a pain. But I can protect myself, it's fine. Yeah, you have a relic. I have a relic. Too. Other fact, yeah. I kind of want to get healed. Okay. Which is bad. Interesting. Now I will get a um, a nicker as my first action. Mm -hmm. Then I will force revive the guy. For three. Okay. And then I will play an action card, which allows me to gain one additional action this turn. Great. And I will. You play one of them? I can play more because of this. Oh wow. Forgot. You shouldn't have. <laughs> so, yes, um, uh, as a conclusion of my turn, I will complete a mission, which will be this one. Right. I will complete it only for this because it's discounted if I don't reserve it. Do you get a point? I do get a point. Not enough. That's it, so the beasts uh, move. Yeah, they do. So this oh, stands up. Two more turns, do not catch up. I feel like Nikita yeah. has some like crazy plan that he can catch I have up. Crazy like plan. Eight points in this turn. This one will go here then. Yep. That's all. Yay, I'm dead. Yeah. Uh, no, this is, you just got the resource. Oh yeah, that's true. I cannot see. You are done. <laughs> this got the resource. No! Okay, let me think. No. I do not move this one. Okay, let's see a new mission as well. Yep. Okay, so it's on you again. Okay. Okay. okay, 
so much. Now one of the beasts is gone. Oh, you're right. And this goes to here. Oh, yeah. Oh, right. Two more turns. Mm. Yep. Okay, so for my whole turn, I can just choose to gain three acre. Is that correct? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Okay, so that is all my whole turn. And then I can start, start doing beats. Oh, wow. So I would like to, first of all, spend two acre for an artifact. For an artifact. Thank you. And then at the end of my turn, I would like to purchase Boots of Speed. So Boots of Speed will cost me three of these, one acre, mm -hmm. and one of these. How many points? Um, three points. Yeah. Okay. What does it do? Okay, so basically I'm going to replace this mm -hmm. with that one. So whenever I force provide a scout, I can immediately place wow. action on it. Speed. Yeah. Okay, on me, I guess I will... Hmm. Should I survive one more turn or... Yes, I can so. Yeah. Okay, I'll do this. And then I will gain the nick of the <laughs> And then I'm gonna try and do a mission. Oh, can I see a new one? Yeah, sorry. Oh, so this one's actually free for me because I get it is to ignore the Icar cost of the mission. What? It's one point, it's one free point. But it takes an action, so you might want to buy something more expensive if you Yeah, I think one. so. I think you're right. Um we don't have weapon then. Just the two points that we'll, we'll do. That one over there, the two knowledge. Yeah. The two of these, one of these. Oh, I and I to get to reserve a mission. So I will reserve. I guess this one. Okay. Cool. It's free, mm -hmm. so I have a choice. So two points. Yeah. Not three, two points. Yep. Two. There you go. Nice. Okay. On me. So I will get three acre as my two actions. Okay. Um, and I will play like this card. I will flip the beast oh. to nice. keep us safe. Unfortunately. That's kind of you. <laughs> um, and then. I can. I don't think I can complete a mission this turn. Oh, in fact, I can. So I'll complete the mission. Okay. Spending this, two of those, three of those. I have a discount, and then spending one of them. Wow. Great. That was That's perfect. Four points. Right there. That's a lot. Four points. One, yeah. two, and then one to two. Yeah. Four to two. And when completed, you reserve all missions. For the yes, time. I did. In fact. Cool. I guess at least we'll see some new ones. See if I can do some things before I Something. unleash my plan. Uh, also, whenever I complete a mission because of this, I can revive a guy for one acre. Watch, I will do. Okay, so beasts will move. This guy will move here and devour you, Nikita. Not great. And the Not other terrible. one stands up. And this one stands up then. Yep. Yes. And I will. Get an additional achievement. Might be right. useful. So now it's the uh, last turn. Wow. Starting with you, Jinji. I am scared Nikita is going to devour me, and so therefore, is there anything I can purchase? Not really, it's too expensive. Um, hmm. Where am I right now? Okay, I'm going to try my luck. So, first of all, I'm going to spend my last acre mm -hmm. and this resource to move myself up one space and try to draw a tactic card that makes all the difference mm -hmm. in the world. Good luck. Pew! And it's up the one. Cool. Okay, so I'm going to play this one. So each one of you will get um, a tactics card. Every player, including you. No, uh, each player, yep, including me. And then I get a point. Well, that's, huh. that is the most important at this point. Okay, this is the best. Ready? Oh, I can't play two at the same turn. Okay. Give it to me. <laughs> oh, it's so good though. Okay, so for my turn, um, that's not my turn yet. So this is just the fact of that card. Yep. And then can I get three acres? Yep. I'm just gonna forget about my babies. Get three acres and spend two more acres to perform this action. You get an so artifact. So I'm just gonna get an artifact. Okay. Cool. Yep. And that is my turn. Cannot do anything else. 
Okay. Yeah. Well, close. Okay, so now it's me. I'm going to uh, see if there's anything useful here. Oh, take two. Unfold your grand plan. Sure. <laughs> I will attempt to unfold said plan. Uh, I will get, I guess, two weapons. Uh, with the tactics card there, and then I will. Ah, uh, not yet. So I will recall. So I will spend three and recall that. All oh, right. Oh, this guy unfortunately will stay put. And uh, so I can complete two tower rooms as long as I have the mission, which I do this turn. So that's potentially a lot of points. And uh, that is it. Uh, I will do a mission. Yeah. So that one. It was, this one. Yeah. I'm impeachment sure. for you. Impeachment. Be careful before you answer that question. <laughs> All right, move me up one, uh, two points. Okay. Ooh, okay, that was some help. All right. Can you purchase this one for 55 points? I wish. I wish I had resources. You don't have resources. I'm just trying to keep Akita from surpassing me. Okay, okay. so now I come to Will. I don't think so. Pretty sure okay. you look me in the eye and tell you. <laughs> oh, I know. Now I get to do two of these rooms. So I get to place two of my tokens and get 10 points. What? Oh, uh, Where did that come from? Ooh, that is. Whoa! Ooh. Oh, she's not stacking we'll up on top of me. <laughs> that is just wrong. Oh, still not quite enough. You still win if you have the most points at the end. Yeah. You'll still win based on the tiebreaker, which is. Uh, well, if I don't win. First player. Right, if you don't win. Let's see. Let's see what Let's happens. see. Let's which see your big and massive plan with one acre that you have left. Which is a thing which might happen this turn unless you do something. So mm -hmm. this is, I guess, this is not happening. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. So let me think. I will spend my a thing, my uh, action. two additional action token. Yep. I will spend two actions this turn to get three acre. Okay. And your last action. And I will spend one acre. So give me just two. Mm -hmm. Then we'll collect this guy. Okay. Thus being eligible to complete the tower room. However, before that, I will complete this mission for one point. Wow. Uh, I only need to spend two acre. Yep. Now, I am eligible to complete a mission, uh, to tower. complete a tower room, which is seven points for me because of oh, the room. Jeez. Wow. What? Oh, and man. Don't ever play with the designer. I'm just yeah. kidding. Also, the designer wins. <laughs> I tried um, so hard, guys. So there, there is still a B space. So if this happens, uh, this guy dies, and then there's not one, which doesn't do much, unfortunately. But anyway, and then he disappears, and that is the end. So Ooh! You saved the one. Yeah, and, uh, I would just the design out of one. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. Like usual. <laughs> it was close, though. It was really close. It was so, pretty close. Um, it was pretty close. Yeah. I oh, I spent forever making there. that combat, guys. All right. Okay. Well, thank you for watching, guys. Thank and, you. Uh, Hopefully we'll see you around soon. Um, if you're if you're interested in you know watching more videos like this or you have any questions, just ping us in the comments. And thank you for your support. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, thank you for staying with us all this time, and thank you for enduring our jokes. <laughs> <laughs> and see you soon. Okay. Bye bye. See you soon. Bye.